Now let's talk about lipids. Now a lipid, if you look at this model, and you'll see, I'm going to go back to the PowerPoint in a second, it's actually not complete. So what I, what I want you to see is see this is a one, two, three carbon chain called glycerol. Now it turns out each one of these glycerols has a fatty acid attached. Fatty acid attached. Now what I, if you look, if you call that one, two, three, I haven't added one to one. I'm going to do that in a second. But let's so what is it? A triglyceride, one glycerol. And so if you see right over here, this is the glycerol. And now watch what happens. You add in a fatty acid. This did it to the middle. Add in another one, another one. And there you go. This is actually called a ester linkage. Carbon, oxygen, the carbon, that's an ester linkage. So we've, I'm going to talk about all the macromolecules, how the actual bond is created. And, and this is a series where I'm using the models. So We'll do all of them. Well, actually, we'll do carbohydrates. Now we're doing lipids. So let's go ahead and just make this ester linkage. So let's say, so here we have, it's a classic dehydration synthesis. So what I have to do is, as you see here, I'm going to take, there's a hydrogen and there's a OH. Here is your water. Water comes out. And here, as you look at the purple bond, is your ester linkage. Now I have a, I actually have a triglyceride. I have a glycerol, and coming off each glycerol, carbon one, here's a fatty acid chain, here's a fatty acid chain, and here is a fatty acid chain. Actually, we have a unsaturated here beca because it's a double bond. This one right here, the fatty acid chain is uh, single. So that's saturated, saturated, unsaturated. So that's a short little look at lipids. So we're going to move on to our next model, um, and that will be uh, proteins.